Warren Buffett, arguably the world's greatest investor and the Oracle of Omaha, famously said, if you can't find a way to make money while you sleep, you're going to work until you die. The easiest way to make money while you sleep is through passive income. You might have heard passive income mentioned on social media or in a book. It's just the simple idea of making money without having to trade your time. Every day when I wake up and have my coffee, my websites have already made money for me and I didn't have to trade any of my time. But the big thing about passive income is, of course, nothing in life is free and you have to spend the time setting up and building your passive income streams so then they can make money for you and compound over time. I spent over a thousand hours blogging until I made my first dollar, but now I've made over $10 million blogging and it's been that effort that compounded over time. So now I wanna cover five of the best passive income streams to help you think about how you can make money in your sleep. Number five, let's talk about micro investing. So investing in anything is the expectation that it will go up in value over time. You can invest in literally anything from sports cars to houses to the stock market to watches. But micro investing is really just what it says. It's starting very small in a way that helps you make and save more over time. The easiest way to start micro investing is to download an app like Acorns, which simply invest your spare change after you make every purchase. Now, you're not gonna be able to retire on the money that you save in Acorns, but it's an easy way to start investing between $200 and $1,000 per year, and then that money will be making money while you sleep. The thing about passive income streams is even starting small, the compounding impact over time can be incredible. And you don't just wanna have one passive income stream, you wanna have a bunch. And so start small with a micro investing app and build from there. Number four, I wanna talk about larger long-term investing. We talked about micro investing. Now let's talk about investing in the US stock market. Whenever you buy a stock, you're actually buying a piece of ownership in a company, a business. When you own Amazon stock, every Amazon delivery driver you see actually works for you. And so when you invest in a total stock market index fund like VTSAX, you own over 2,000 companies. And so every day, those employees are working for you. You can invest through a 401k or an IRA. There are many different types of accounts and we're not gonna cover those in this video, but the important thing is if you have an employer-sponsored retirement plan, you should be investing as much money as you can in it, not only to get the tax benefits, but that's just more money that's making money for you. Once you maximize your retirement plan at your work, you can launch your own individual retirement account, either a traditional IRA or a Roth IRA, where you can save over $6,000 of additional money in a retirement account that can continue to grow over time. So with your micro investment app and investing in your employer account and your individual retirement account, you're gonna be saving a lot of money that's making money over time while you sleep. I encourage every investor to use both of these strategies as a base for passive income to build on. Number three is real estate. I've always said that the fastest path to financial independence is investing in real estate because it's a win-win-win proposition. The great thing about investing in real estate is you can use the bank's money to buy a property. You don't have to put down a million dollars to buy a million dollar house. All you need is $200,000 for the down payment. And if you're a first time home buyer, you might need even lower of a down payment. The great thing about real estate is you can use the bank's money in order to make money. The great thing about real estate too is over time, on average, real estate tends to appreciate, meaning it goes up in value, especially in cities and larger markets. There's only so many places that people can live. And as the world population grows and demand for housing continues to grow, over the long term, it's likely that real estate in most markets will continue to grow in value. So you're using the bank's money to buy something that will go up in value over time 
and then you can also get renters for your property. So you don't have to be the one paying your mortgage. You can have someone else paying it through rental income over time as that rental income pays down your mortgage. What happens is the property then becomes cash flow positive where that extra cash then can go into your bank account or you can use it to buy other real estate investment properties. Now, you might not be ready to buy a home yet, but I encourage you to think seriously about adding real estate as a form of passive income and as a form of diversification into your portfolio. Number two on the list of best passive income streams is starting a business. A vast majority of the world's wealthiest people have one thing in common. They're entrepreneurs. They own their own time. They're able to create value by growing a business. Now, you don't have to become the next Bill Gates or Jeff Bezos, but creating a business that you can grow and make money on your own time and then hire employees or contractors and start selling their time is a simple way to right now build passive income streams in your life. As I'm recording this video, I now have seven people working for me and probably the most that I can work in a day is about 10 hours. But having seven team members, that extends the amount of time I can work from 10 hours to over 80 hours in one day. That gives me more opportunities to grow my business and make money. Of course, entrepreneurship means something different to everybody, but I encourage you to make the best investment that you can, and that's in yourself and in your own earning potential. A vast majority of the money that I've made has been through my own businesses. And you might not think that you're an entrepreneur, but one of the best passive income streams you can build are things where you no longer have to trade your time for money. And number one on the list of best passive income streams is building an audience. As we move into an increasingly digital economy, building a platform, whether it's a blog or a social media following or some way to monetize a group of people is going to help make you more resilient and adaptable amidst increasing uncertainty. There's so many ways that you can make money after you have an audience, whether it's writing a book or launching a podcast or launching a product. Community is actually currency in the digital economy and it's important to start building your audience no matter what career or business that you decide to start.